I'm going to play a game of solitaire for American Mahjong using the National Mahjong League card. If you have a set of tiles at home and you can compartmentalize your decision making, there's a lot that can be learned in playing a game of solitaire. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. Player 1 will get 14 tiles. Players 2, 3, and 4 will get 13 each. Then we're going to look at each player's hand See where the strengths lie. Maybe pick out a category to play. We may even be able to pick out a hand. Everybody has their tiles. Let's see what we can do for player one, also known as East. We have a flower, red and green dragon, five, six in bams, one, two, nine in dots with a pung of nines, four, seven, eight in cracks with a pair of sevens. These were your tiles. What would you focus on? And what would be your first pass? If these were my tiles, I would build around the nines. We could play either six through nine consecutive run or three, six, nine if we get threes. But I think we could even consider big odds five, seven, nine. So I would keep tiles five through nine, consider keeping threes if they come around and see what happens. Five through nine, three, six, nine, or big odds. And I wouldn't pick a hand in any of those categories. We have one, two, four to pass. That is risky, especially with the year being 2021. So what I would probably do is keep the two and give up one of the dragons. I think that's what I would pass. Let's see what we can do for player two, also known as South. North, two, six, eight, nine in cracks, two, seven in dots with a pair of sevens. Two, four, eight, nine, and bams with a pair of eights. If these were your tiles, what would you focus on and what would be your first pass? If these were my tiles, I would focus on six through nine, building around seven, eight, but I would also keep the two bam. Because if we get a four crack and flowers, we may even be able to play a two, four, six, eight hand. Here's six through nine with a potential for two, four, six, eight. We would have to break up a pair of seven dots though. So I would say that would be unlikely and we need to pass. I would not pass like numbers. So probably pass north two, four. Let's see what we can do for player three, also known as West. We have a red dragon and a green dragon, one, six, eight in dots, one, two, three, four, eight in cracks, two, four, six in bams. If these were your tiles, what would you focus on and what would be your first pass?
If these were my tiles, I would focus on evens. And I would just gather evens until a multiple forms and then reassess. 2468, with or without dragons. There are two dragon hands. One is a matching dragon, and one is offsuit dragons. White dragon, green dragon, red dragon, white dragon. I would not pass like numbers. We have two eights, two fours, two sixes, and two twos. Mixed suits. I think I would give up a green dragon here. Pass green one three. Gather two four six eight. Let's see what we can do for player four, also known as North. We have a joker, west and south, white dragon, four, five, six in dots, four, five, six in cracks, three, five, eight in bands. No multiples. If these were your tiles, what would you focus on? And what would be your first pass? If these were my tiles, I would play consecutive run three through six. Four numbers in a range. Three, four, five, six. I wouldn't pick a hand. Gather the category when a multiple forms reassess. I would not pass a white dragon. And passing west south with news all over the card, that would be a little bit risky. Four, five, six, we have I think to break this up a little, I would give up that three and focus on four, five, six. We can recover from a three later or maybe build up towards seven. Everybody has their pass identified, so we can do the Charleston. First right, east to south, south to west, west to north, north to east. We want big odds, three, six, nine, or six, seven, eight, nine, five through nine consecutive run. Three different categories here. Building around seven, nine. We have a three. That is an odd tile, and it's also three, six, nine. I think I would keep it and pass two south eight. Eight is in our range, but we're kind of skipping a number unless we focus on seven, eight, nine. Mixed suit Kongs. Three, six, nine. Seven, eight, nine. Maybe we could pass south to red. Keep the three. Green one, four. We're playing six through nine. I don't think the dragon will be helpful. We have a one in here. What we could maybe do, this is where I was thinking maybe we could play two, four, six, eight. There's the fourth hand down, two, four, six, eight, the offsuit in the middle with flowers. That would leave year tiles to pass. I don't know if I would do that. 
I think there's more flexibility with consecutive run. I think we should focus on 7-8 consecutive run. Let's pass 1. Actually, let's pass 2-4 green. At least we're breaking up the 2s. Because if we get everything we want, we're, we could be stuck with like numbers of 2s. That's risky with 2021 being the year. So let's break those up. We're focused on two, four, six, eight, and we have a four and a two. There's tiles to pass. We can just gather. We did build up our first multiple. So we're gonna keep an eye on that. Pair fours. Let's pass those and we'll keep gathering. We're focused on four, five, six. We did get a three. So now we've recovered a three. We passed the three bam. So we've recovered a three and we have tiles we can pass. Now there is some potential here for the concealed hand. Let's see. Three, four, four, five, five, six, dragon. Four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. Let's let the bam go and focus on these two suits with or without dragons. We're going to go across now. We did get a red dragon, but with seven, nine, I don't think that red dragon's gonna be helpful. Let's give up this three, pass north, red, three. We have a five. Oh, there's a new multiple, one. That's not helpful though. We have seven, eight. Build around the most of your multiples that go together, seven, eight. So I would break up that one, pass the west. I would not pass two with one because of the year. This five feels like it doesn't belong. So I would focus on six through nine, pass the five. We picked up a multiple with our two. So now we have two and four. We have two tiles to pass. So we're gonna need to give something up here. I'm thinking maybe we could play the concealed hand. Two, four, six, eight with fours. Two, four, we have a gap. Six, eight with pungs of fours. Pung, single, single, pung, pung, pung kind of an odd shape. We have a red and a south. So we need to give something up. We could do two, four, six, eight with twos. We could maybe even play a pair hand. Two, four, six, eight with twos. So let's focus on twos and fours and let the eight crack go. That was a tough choice. I'd say we're between the concealed even hand or the two, four, six, eight pair hand. So here we have three through six. We do have a two and a four. Hey, there's our first multiple. Oh, and there's a green dragon. Multiples, four dragon. 
This is where I would maybe consider playing the concealed consecutive hand. We do have a tile here that might help with that. We have a six here with our four, four, five, six. The other dragon hand in the consecutive run category is matching dragons. So we could do three, four dragon. So let's give up the six. And we need one more tile here. Let's pass any odd tile and maybe focus on that concealed hand. Now we do have a gap, no flowers. We may draw one out of the wall. We are now doing first left, east to north, north to west, west to south, south to east. Oh, we got a multiple, a five. Five, seven, nine odds. Each suit represented there. We do have a concealed hand that we could play, but we've got gaps. We need seven bam, five crack, and we'd have to let a nine dot go. We don't have any three dots. I was thinking about the one, three, five, seven, nine second hand from the bottom. I don't think that one would be very helpful, really. Uh, let's see, what else could we do here? Five, seven, nine. We have like numbers with ones. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight consecutive run. Second hand down. We'd have to let a pung of nines go. I think what I would do here is let that eight go. Let's see how this develops. Well, we got a multiple built in there. Eight, eight, seven, eight, nine, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine. Let's pass one dragon south. We'll just keep building. Well, we got a multiple. We have two, four, six, two, six, eight, two, four, six. Okay, we have one tile to pass. We did first left, we're going into second left. We could stop the Charleston, but we don't even know what hand we're playing. I would not stop the Charleston. I would whittle this down to release some discards. We have two, four, six, eight. That's a hand. Second hand down, no gaps. We have a pair of twos that we wouldn't be using. The other thing we could maybe do is focus on the pair hand. We need an eight bam, of course. That would free up tiles. That's a little bit risky though. Since we have multiples with twos, let's pass on the eight. Oh, actually, I hmm, think no matter how we slice this, it could be a challenge. Maybe we can make it a little better by passing those. At least we're left with four, six indifferent suits. We have a dragon. Three, four, five dragon. Four, six, three north. Four. I was thinking we could maybe play like numbers with fours and dragons. It'd be nice if we had four bams though. Let's pass the six dot and we're going to keep going. East to north, north to west, west to south, south to east. Oh, we 
ones, I would stick with it. Multiple. Here's an eight. Six, eight, nine, seven, eight, eight, nine. We've got tiles we can work with. We even have consecutive pairs in mixed suits. Six, seven, eight. If we can get flowers, we could play the fifth hand down on the right. We're going across. We need three tiles. Let's pass nine crack. Two, four, six, eight. We really want to get that eight bam, I think. Two, four, six. Let's keep the six past the four. One west eight. Our, we have a four here, so I don't think that is going to be any help. So we're ready now to go across. We got the three back. Let's pass those. Ooh, eight. Six, seven, eight. If we can just get some flowers. Eight, eight. We have all the eights. Let's pass that nine. Six, seven, eight. Mix suit Kongs. We just need flowers. Or we could switch to like numbers with eights. Still need flowers. We got a one. If we had white dragons, I would consider switching to a year hand, but we don't have any. So I think I would just pass those. We've got a two, two, three, four, five dragon. There's a hand there. Third one down under consecutive run. I think I would go ahead and pass these. We could still maybe do four or five dragon or three, four dragon or two, three, four, five dragon. We are now doing last right, north to east, east to south, south to west, west to north. Four, five, nine. That's in our range. Seven, eight, nine, nine. We have a pung of nines there. I think I would break this up. Maybe pass three, four, nine in the optional cross. No keepers. Now we did get a four. If we get a two crack, we could switch to two, four, six, eight pair hand. Let's keep that four, six, eight, like numbers with eights. Let's just pass two in the optional cross. We could still do six, seven, eight mixed suit Kongs. We want evens in here. So those we can pass. We picked up another dragon. Two, three, four, five dragon. Let's pass two. They actually both went two. Okay, optional cross. Three, two. Nine. We did get a five. 
five, seven, nine. I would just hold them all and see what develops. No keepers. We've got a four. There's a three, two, three, four. I think two, four, six, eight looks pretty good here. I would focus on two, four, six, eight, maybe even the pair hand. No keepers. We could still maybe play the concealed hand. Two discards, two discard. Everyone has two discards. A lot of decision making needs to happen here. If you want to be the fifth player, pause the video and look at these tiles. Decide who you think has the best potential to win and write your guess in the comment section below. Let's start by discarding a West. We'll use this to mark whose turn it is. This is Mahjong dice. Look at that Joker. So cute. Five dot. We're focused on seven, eight, nine. I don't think that's going to be helpful, but we're not using wins, so let's discard south. Joker. Okay, we're not playing a pair hand now. Not with a joker. Maybe the two, four, six, eight concealed hand. Let's discard nine crack. Four bam. Oh, we want cracks. We're not playing wins though. Let's discard north. Apparently, wins are going to be safe discards. Five bam. We're going to continue to build. Oh, look, five, six, seven, eight. We have a pung we don't need right now. Let's discard one crack. Four. Four, six, eight. I don't think we can use that. Let's discard one dot. One bam, three bam. Let's discard three bam. Two bam. One dot was discarded. Let's discard that. Three crack. We're collecting big numbers. Now up here, Two, three, four, five, single pair, Pung Kong. We need a pair here if we're going to play that dragon hand. Six bam. Feels like two, four, six, eight is coming in. Let's discard five dot. Five crack. We don't need the one bam or the five crack, really. Two, four, six, eight is what we're playing here. North. Six dot. Five, seven, nines. I think five, seven, nine. Well, we do have five, six, seven, eight in here, though. Five, six, seven, eight. We might be able to, I don't think this five is going to help either. There's one already out. Keep them in order here. Two, 
two dot two four six eight. This keeps wanting to go two four six eight. Look at all this two four six eight now. Or like numbers with eights or six through eight. With a pung of eights like that, I think I would not focus on two, four, six, eight. I think consecutive run might be better. Let's discard two dot. This is probably a concealed hand. Seven crack. North. South. Nobody's playing wins. One bam. Three dot. Let's discard five crack. Oh, up here we need Kong. Single pair Pung Kong. Oh, flower. We got a flower. Maybe we could play the concealed hand. Let's discard two bam. This is probably concealed. One bam. Three dot. We've got a six crack in here now. We need eights. Let's discard three dot. Last tile, second wall. Red dragon. Single pair Pung Kong. I think I would try that dragon hand. We need a pair for the three crack. There's one out. Let's discard four bam. One bam. Ooh, eight dot. I would consider switching to like numbers with eights. We need flowers. Seemed like we had too many tiles in there. We just need to discard. Four crack. It's this player's turn, but this player could pung. I think we should. It's a little risky because we need a pair here. We're going to risk it and see how it goes because we could Kong here. Let's discard the flower. With a Pung of fours, we actually could switch to that fourth hand down. Let's keep that flower and discard this white dragon. Joker. All right, we need to figure this out now here. Let's see, five, six, seven, eight. Pung Kong, Pung Kong, no gaps. Those nines are not helpful with these particular tiles. If we had seven dots, seven bam, we might be able to make a big odd hand work. Right now, I don't think so. Let's discard nine bam. Flower. That's what we needed for either like numbers with eights or six, seven, eight. We definitely don't need the four dot. We're going to have to keep an eye on eights. Even if an eight went down, the only one we could really act on is the eight bam. 
if we play like numbers with eights or even six, seven, eight mixed suit Kongs. Joker. Okay, so I definitely wouldn't play the pair hand here. I think I might focus on the concealed hand. We could do two, four, six, eight in dots with pungs of twos. We wouldn't need that six unless we were to switch to two, four, six, eight with sixes. Two, four, six, eight. We wouldn't need the four. Either way, we're going to have to break up a pair. We could do two, four, six, eight, use these for the missing eight and sixes, or we could do two, four, six, eight in dots with probably twos. Let's see, two, four, six, eight in dots with twos. So let's discard. Six crack. Four dot. Five dot. That's out. Five crack is out. Four crack. I think I would stick with the plan. Four crack. It's up, oops, up here anyway. Eight dot. This hand is not ready for like numbers or even anything else with the eight dot. I would stick with the plan of either like numbers with eights or six, seven, eight mixed suit Kongs. Two crack. We're going to have to keep an eye on that. Five crack. Nine bam. Seven crack. Down here, we need to pung that if we're playing that second consecutive run hand. I think I would. I'd commit. We don't even have to use a joker there. We're going to need help right here. Let's test the waters and discard nine dot. Nobody wants it. One dot. One dot. We need a keeper. White dragon. Seven dot. Oh, now we get a seven dot. We committed there. I was thinking five, seven, nine. Nobody wanted that nine. Let's discard it. Nine crack. Eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine. I don't think that's going to be helpful though. South. Four dot. Seven bam. Now we start getting five, seven, nine. Can you believe that? Well, let's let this nine dot go. Nobody wants those. Seven. Hmm. Seven. Seven, bam, seven, eight, seven, eight. We did let the nine crack go, I think. That's okay. I would still focus on like numbers with eights or six, seven, eight, mixed suit Kongs. Seven, bam. 
That will be a good discard, probably. White Dragon. We could maybe play 2468 with Dragons, but we still have a gap and we still have potential for that concealed hand. I think I would discard the White Dragon. There's already one out anyway. All right, now we need a keeper here. Nine crack. Looks pretty, not the right tile. Drawing, three dot. Uh oh We got a joker. We have to make a choice. Really, we don't need the six. We could play six, seven, eight, six, seven, eight Kongs or like numbers with eights. Let's discard six spam. We can't do anything here. I think we're playing concealed. One crack. Keeper. No, seven dot. So these are good discards, I think. Now this player could Kong. We need to make a decision here. We could Kong that with this Joker. We have one, two, three multiples. One, two, three multiples. Six crack, seven dot. There's a seven dot out. Let's focus on like numbers with eights. Actually, we're kind of in between. It's really six one half dozen the other. Is there a six crack out? Yes, there is a six crack out. So let's, let's not take it. Let's focus on like numbers with eights. If nothing else, we have a pair of eights in there and we need a pair. Let's draw. Nine crack. We could do five, seven, nine. Now there are nine, we could do five, seven, seven, nine. There's an, there are two nine cracks out though. Let's not. Seven dot was discarded. Let's discard that. We're gonna stick with it. Five, six, seven, eight. Three, four, four. Wait, what's going on here? Four, four, five. No, we're good. Five, six, seven, eight. We have a ways to go. We should probably discard that flower. Seven dot went down. Three, bam. Nobody wants that either. Red dragon. These are offsuit dragons. We don't have any other dragons. Red dragon. Up here, we're gonna Kong. Kind of risky, we need that three. Let's discard green. What we probably need to do here is let that flower go. Okay, let's discard flower. First flower out. Nobody wants it, or nobody's ready right now. Five dot. Oh, you know, nobody's wanting these sevens. Nobody wants the five either. North. We need a three crack. One crack. All right, let's discard the flower. Joker. That is very, very helpful. We need to Kong here. Let's discard nine crack. Just seems like there's not enough tiles here. Four, four, five. That's right. Has that ever happened to you? You feel like you don't have enough tiles? Okay, we're gonna draw. Last tile, third wall. Six dot, we need eights. Let's let the five dot go.
joker. We still don't have an eight. Thankfully, we can use jokers for that concealed hand. Okay, now I think we can probably play two, four, six, eight. We could still maybe do two, four, six, eight. Let's see here. We don't have six cracks. Let's discard six dot. We need singles right there. Two, four, six, eight with cracks. This is a little risky because there's a two crack out and the four cracks are out too. I think there's one four crack and one two crack out. Oh, four cracks are up here. So we'll have to get rid of those. It's two crack for this player. Two dot. This player's concealed. West. We need eights. We got a flower. We needed that. Let's discard seven dot. We need to probably discard those sixes. South. Oh. Three dot. That is out. Three crack. That's a tough situation here. There's only one more. West. Eight bam. There's the first eight. Two, four, eight, twos. Two, 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 four, six, eight. Let's discard four bam. This is getting scary for these players. Seven bam. Nine dot. <laughs> We gave away a Kong and nine dots. Okay, now we need some help in here. Eights. We got a seven. Green dragon. I'm kind of thinking we should maybe keep that green dragon. Switch to one suit if that two goes down. Let's discard six dot. West. We need that last three really badly, or a five, and then we could Kong. Green Dragon. It's kind of tough for that player. I would not take that. I would stick with that concealed hand. Flower. We really don't need that. Oh, we do. We need a Kong of flowers, not a pear. We did need that. Oh my goodness. Okay. Six dot. Probably should have thrown this six crack. We're in the end game. Flower. I would keep it in case we need to switch to the first hand. Four dot. It's good to have options. Five bam. We needed the five crack. East. A crack. Oh my goodness. That's beautiful. Six crack. Eight dot. Let's discard eight dot. We could take it here, but we're we're set to Kong. We're set to Kong. 
I think I would let it go. You can't think about what's going on in here. Because one thing I was thinking is we could Kong it here and then use this for the pair. But this is ready to Kong. And we could even maybe do this pure. I think I would let it go. East. Six bam, that is a keeper. Oh my goodness, okay, good. Six dot. Oops. One crack. Flower, okay. We need to make a choice in here. Flower. At this late stage, we can still play the concealed hand. Let's discard the flower. It's a little risky and we're gonna Kong. Kong, six crack. So we're ready to win on an eight bam or an eight crack. Two bam. Let's discard flower. Joker, we needed that. Green dragon. All right. Four bam. Everybody's good. East. Two crack. Wow. Green dragon. They're almost, they're almost winning. We're one away there. Ready to win, one away. Three bam. Oh, really, two more picks each. Nine bam. Let's discard seven bam. Okay, we need an eight bam or an eight crack. We wouldn't know that it's here and here. White dragon. Six crack. East. Flower. Nobody took them. Three bam. Last tile. Three crack. Whoops. We'll discard a joker. Last tile. All right. Nobody won. Wall game. And I think it's because of two, four, six, eight. Eights consecutive run that included eight. Even up here, we have some two, four, six, eight with two, four. So everybody was in everybody's business. There's their tile. There's their tile and their tile. I bet on North. They had no gaps and jokers. I was thinking about really everybody was set up pretty well. I was, I think, in between these three and went with that one. This is the player closest to a win. I think this 
these two players were close to. This player had a hard time. Five, six, seven, eight. No gaps, but the big multiples weren't ready. American Mahjong is a very flexible game, but it's also complex. If you want to practice your decision making and you have a set of tiles at home, try playing solitaire and let me know if it helps build your confidence. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do, that way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.